Hi everyone, it's Bonnie. I just wanted to share with you how to create this cute little bow. I call it a fourth bow. I learned it from my friend Patty at a regional many years ago up in um, Hartford, believe it or not. And it still sticks with me. It's I still use it to this day because I think it has a cute little impact on my cards. So um, the gingham ring ribbon works perfectly with it. And this was a card that I posted today and I'm currently working on my um, website post and I thought it would be great to add it. So I'm just gonna demo just how to make this cute little bow. So you're gonna grab your ribbon now, I normally just eye it because I've been doing it for so long. You don't need a huge amount because there's not a lot of ribbon being shown there. But I'm going to probably, let you, this is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to eyeball it. And then let's see down here. It's about six inches I'm going to cut off. Okay. So cutting off six inches of the lovely Knight of Navy gingham ribbon. You're going to put the two ends together, kind of make a little hole there and you're going to wrap it around your fork. Now I'm hoping you guys can see this. I know it's late and I haven't done a Facebook live in a long time so I'm going to hold it up. Now what you're going to do is you're going to kind of maneuver the top part of the ribbon a little longer. We're going to wrap it under and through the middle. So can you guys see that? So I have this little tag and then I have this little tag. So I'm hoping you can see. So I wrapped it up around the top. Okay. Now I'm going to take this little piece and I'm going to put it down through the center. Hold on. And pull it through. So you can kind of see right there, my little fork bow is starting. You can use different size forks. It doesn't have to be just the dinner fork, but I just happened to use the dinner fork. You're going to turn it over and then all you're going to do is tie one knot. And is this not crazy, but I'm gonna do it on the first try. Love when that happens. How's that? So now, you see, I just tied a little knot. This is the front side. This is the back side. I'm just gonna pop it off. I'm gonna show you again. Hold on, let me try and fit this that focus button there. So you can see I have my little fork bow. And then I just, I'm gonna show you the six inches, I can wrap it around my little banner here to get the same effect. Is that not super cute? I hope that was helpful. And I hope you'll make lots of fork bows in your future. Bye.